Kate Miller Fulcher, welcome to Tony Creates and another session in our Excel journal. Uh, sewn them in, guys. Sewn it in, all the signatures in. Uh, this is going to be our closure, which we'll sort out later, and I sewed that in as well. Might come and put a wee bit of glue on either side just to relieve any strain the tugging might put on our now sewing in so what I have I did I put it this side this side we have these two to put in I just want to put them in quickly and then we're going to get our feathers and cut some journal cards and what what so we'll just work work in the smaller one I'm obsessed now because um, my camera shut off again so I'm like what to do right so i did these these are just envelopes we're going to come and put this in here like that and then we're going to go whee, pink to go with our pink roses okay so i think i'm just going to stick this down and then hmm <laughs> right we're going to stick it down like that folks we're going to stick it down like that and then it's going to be a flip out and then we are going to come and put some more of this pink washi down or something else down so that's just a flip up but what i need to do is actually open them i haven't opened the envelope yet so that this is open i'm just going to go like that that should be open so that it's open and i put card on this side to just give it a little bit more stability so I think we're going to so put that one in like that. Oh, let's get the other one out. And let's, uh, oops, nearly, nearly did the wrong side, guys. Nearly. Okay, just cutting off a sliver. Right. Let's put that to one side. Let's get this down. I just want to get... these and use these and then we'll get our feather ones out and we will start making um journaling cards tags what 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 so this is going like that and i think i've gone and put that pink washi away And I'll put this other washi down that's already down there now just to reinforce the actual spine of the flip out. Um, and this is what I'm going to do. I'm just going to take my, my sticky things and just put them down there so I don't go and close it. Let's go like this, folks. And we want to get right on the edge of this page like that. All right, uh, let me get my board. I've just got my. Let's see. Okay, I just want to get this under there, go like that. And then just make sure all of now, this is um, the sticky side of the end. This was a, a new envelope, it wasn't a used one. Just going to get that down. Um, should we do do the the pink look a little bit of blue here i wonder if we shouldn't do some blue washi i think i'm gonna i'm gonna put some blue washi down Let's go like that, folks. Let's put blue washi down, and then in the middle of that, we're going to put some ribbon. What have I got? Blue washi. What are we going to put? So I'm taking the blue washi to the end of this, like there, like that. Okay. And then we need to just put something in the middle. 
something green I think I've got green ribbon but it is like bright green I'm just looking at my stack here oh you know what I've got this rick rack let's put rick rack down there hold on a sec right we've got the rick rack let's get a a piece of rick rack that's gonna go like that and we're gonna cut it off there whoops right now we need the fabric tag hey let's get the fabric tag glue let's put him away just tidy things up a bit woman and i'm just gonna come down here it'll be easier to just go straight down here and then just stick it on whoops and we're just gonna go like that okay get this there we go okay let's go like that like that minute to settle down like that okay let's have a look at this one if this one is going I think this one um, doesn't make any difference if we go this way if we go like that at the bottom this at the bottom pull, pull, pull. Oh, I'm just going to stick it on this page okay so this one we are going to stick right like that okay I'm just going to I'm not going to do it now guys you've seen me stick we need to get on with the um, I'm just going to put that there so now I have to do it so now this one Right, let's get our, our feathers out that we did. Let me see. I think first things first, we do one for this envelope and that's going to be perfecto. So <clears throat> let's just measure how wide our envelope is. So we want it to be more or less the same. So I'm going to go four four and then we're going to use a tab so which one are we going to use this is just paper I need to I need to scan that and I need to scan this one okay so I think I'm going to go for this one gonna go four is the height we want like that four. okay and then I'm just going to get the corner rounder hold on a sec again found this one guys let's uh let's do this one it's not it's not so so lazy let's have a look and see okay. it's not 
Okay, that looks a bit better. Let's get the old. Uh, this is ground espresso, guys. Right, now what are we going to make a tab with? Thinking, thinking, thinking. Um, okay, we need to decorate this. How, what are we going to put on here? Um, I think I might put this dragonfly one on. Just like that, nothing else. Freedom. Not doing it for me. Not doing it for me. Here is oh feathers. Yeah, we have gold feathers, guys. I forgot about these. If I do that, let's do that, guys. I might need to come here. Stick you on there. Let's go. Feather. Feather. Three, eh? Should we just do three? Well, that's nice that they have going in different directions. Okay, let's put one down. Let's put one down and, and decide if we're going to just do a little cluster here. Or if we are going to go... Oopsie, come on. If we are going to go... will you let's go thank you so I think I'm gonna stick this one just like that go like that get him down right, I'm gonna go like that cut him off there we go like so I don't think we'll use that I'll just stick it back on there and then this one, we're going to stick like that. Now this one, um, because there's one already down, I'm going to just give it a wee little bit of a fussy cut so we're not putting the plas plastic on top of the plastic. I'm cutting out all those extra stores. Because I don't want them. There we go. So that's sorted there. Okay. So then we can just stick that down there like that. And then we're going to stick a label. We still have to decide what we're going to use for a tab. I need to maybe go get my tabs that have dingle dangles on them. Like that. I kind of like that. 
and then maybe we do a word coming down coming down let's just hold on a sec got the tabs we've got some vertical words this is from this is from the junk journal studio I think so this is actually the same color as our print yes 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 and then I was thinking here to just anchor these feathers maybe taking this and just putting this bit of lace down here just like that just like that just gonna go like that there we go like that so yeah I think that's cool all right let's um, ink this I don't know what color we've got here just gonna ink this and stick him down so we've got one page done guys yay at last we're getting progress on these journals it's like once you know what to do on a page it's easy to just go to the other one and do it again so guys I'm just like I'm a disaster with these videos my camera shut off again I'm like oh you know right now this is our tabs no to colorful mm. oh la la i think something like this would be quite cool hey i think just like that with a little dingle dangle on it uh, stripy ones maybe no that's too big um, you say why well, put a big thing on a on a chin if if it's on the outside of your journal and it's hanging like this. If I put it on a page like that, it hangs on the outside, then it's not bulky. But when we're going in the middle, we need to be a bit We've got these are more flat, but I don't think the doily goes with our, with our style. Let me just take these out. Got nothing on, but I kind of like the idea of a dingle dangle. So those can still need to be cut out. Let me just stick them in properly. Oh, come on. Um, so um, I kind of like that one. It's got a leaf on it. Okay. Okay. So we've got that one. This one might be a bit too chunky. 
that one's too chunky look what I used here guys just used an earring too chunky to pink to pink oh I like this 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 one because it sticks out of it let's use that one okay these are too flowery right has he been inked he's been inked he's been inked so then we just go like this whoops we go one side we do all of it like that could actually go in there and halfway here and we need to go just halfway because this is going to be on this page like this like that actually let's go in a bit more like that there we go we go should we put a little wee little word there a wee little word we've got words we have words um what are these i know those are my photo um we've got this thing might be good to put a little bit of a let's go up up and i'm just gonna go like that that go like that get a bit of glue on here just be sure to be sure and gonna go like that just need to get that glue up there we go okay folks so this is um, it's just 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 tidy up your workspace woman so you can actually get things on you I'm trying to squeeze it in between all the other rubbish serious where did the sticky piece come from because we need to put it back it was holding something closed wasn't it there we go oh where do you think you're going right so there we've got it let's just leave that there let's bring this back oh here's a random piece of bead that's gone came off something so we are going to take that should be done okay so that is going to go in there like that there we go first one done now this other one's got the pocket on here but here we've got a pocket so i don't know folks i don't know we do, i think i just want to find something for this pocket and we will not we do we don't want to put feathers in here as well um but we do have this how does this go here that goes quite cool hey eh? don't know no I want something with gold or or uh, no okay so we need to make a so we can't do all of them feathers so I need to do another one for the other journal but I think I will use my other feather okay so let me just check the time to see if we have time to do another 20 okay i'm going to show you now guys what we're going to do to get wait what's this this doesn't need to be in there anymore look at that isn't that cool my little pink uh, dingle dangle it's great in there um, what I want to do is I want to get my master board and I think we need to decorate it let's do that oh 
right folks i think i did a video on this this was from kiwi the crook right folks i think i did a video on this this was from kiwi the crafter where you took 12 by 12 papers that you didn't like and these are actually um some of them are one-sided and you just step book page every which way it doesn't matter just cover it with book page so I've, uh, these have been in my bookshelf for yonks and yonks and here's his how to cut it so you have journal card uh, journal card pocket journal card or a pocket so i mean that can go like that or like that so this is to cut it up so i keep this on my bookshelf but i think i'm just going to take one and i'm just going to quickly 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 now this is our painted journal guys so you know what that means we're going to paint okay what color are we going to paint i'm getting some new ones for my birthday from my daughter the uh, art nouveau Genze tembi uh oh we'll just get some gold going here colors so i'm looking forward to that so folks let's get this is i've got these brushes this is actually for japanese calligraphy but um have i gone and bumped you guys let me just check no you still could okay so my water's a bit dirty but anyway we're just gonna we're gonna go we're gonna just we're gonna be we're gonna be very uh now this is book page so it's not gonna it's not gonna um oh it's 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 gonna uh suck up the suck up the okay so green what do we want to put with the green let's put some of this nice turquoise color I like it oh got lots on there this. i wanted to get this brush to just to just slop on paint with guys but it doesn't really slop paint does it it kind of once you okay we're gonna do another color what are we gonna do um the gold let's do gold i'm gonna do gold get some shimmer on there oh that's brown you know Anna. gives us a shimmer okay now we need this to dry this paintbrush is dry now totally wrecked the paintbrush okay right so that's drying nice thing about this is we don't have to back it um i think i might kind of feel like i want to put a contrasting color in here contrasting with green would be purple deep violet that's a bit dark deep pink well, let's go deep violet but we just we just we're just gonna we're just gonna put a little bit on just now oh my goodness that's too much okay you want to be deep there's our bone folder what is it still doing here okay let's just up my white now but that's okay 
Okay, right, I think we need to put some flutter bars on here. Let's uh, get this to dry. Okay, so we can dry this off and hang it up. Right, so we've got that. Let's put this away. Now, it looks, it looks a mess. I'm sorry, trying to get my paint where it's supposed to be. Now let's find. I want, I want butterflies, and we are just gonna stick them on like that. I know it's still wet, guys, but I can't wait. I'm gonna go like that, and in the meantime, it's drying. Hopefully, please. And I'm just sticking these on random. They're gonna be chopped up, guys. Let's get another one. Here's a brown one. Okay. It's just oops, sticking down somewhere. Not even looking, just sticking him down. I like this color. Look at this nice one. Come here. Note to self do not print the butterflies on paper, guys, because then you can only stick them flat. Works. everything is dry I've stuck on a few more butterflies and now I'm going to get this is uh, sketching crayons uh, these are cheaper than buying Tim Holtz I know I'm going to use this color 2454 which is don't know okay so this is going to take a while so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to come here by each butterfly I know it's going to take a while and we're just going to we're just going to grunge it like that just give them a nice outline okay so um, I will speed this up guys so you can just see the effect that this has on each Folks, that's done. My fingers ruined. The dogs want to be let in, but they can stay out there for five, six. Because I just quickly want to do the next step. Right. Um, I'm going to use this spray. 
I'm going to use my Color Boost powder, Burnt Umber, and we are going to use Cracked Pistachio Distress Oxide. So I'm, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to spray this whole thing down, and please God, we don't. This is going to be enough water on here for our color boost. We might have to come and give it some more water. Okay, I think that's enough. Okay, let's just put a bit more water down there. You see, the more water it gets, the more some cases are going to be lighter than others. That's fine. I'm just going to use you to hold that paper down. See, it's quite grungy there. Actually, what I might do is, is go like this a bit, folks. That's me. Let's see, look at him. He's buried in the color. Let's get you out of there. Too much. Put too much on. It's okay. I'm gonna okay. We're going to... We need to resurrect this butterfly okay it's fine if it's just the image I'm gonna be I'm gonna leave it like it is guys I really I'm gonna leave it <laughs> says me picks up the water button but let's start let's get a bit of let's get a bit of grunge down that corner there and now I've covered the whole thing and now I'm gonna just take this this pistachio and we're just gonna Put some color down on here and we're gonna leave that to do its thing and then we're gonna cut this up guys hopefully it's gonna it's gonna dry a bit lighter and then we're gonna cut this up and make journal cards okay so this I'm gonna leave to dry naturally some of this dark, dark color yeah let's see if we can mop up that a bit there just want to resurrect my butterflies then there's no butterfly oh, wait here's one changed its color See you just now. If I stop flapping with all this. Okay, I'm leaving it now. I'm leaving it to dry. I'm gonna put that down there so I can dry flat. And I think we might we might go and prep some white splatter to put some white splatter on this. Okay, see you just now. Right, guys, I'm back. I, I, it's dried a little bit, but I decided I want to. Here's my water. Just trying trying to get this to dry semi flat. Um, <clears throat> I want to put white splatters on, but I decided I want to do it while the paper's still wet, so it's not so they'll they'll spread in a bit, so it won't be like. And then I got my I thought I just the quickest way would just be with the paints, and then I just decided I'm going to use silver. So we're going to have a bit of a shimmer. Okay, I need to. Sure, I've got loads of water on here because this pigment is quite strong and now I need something hard and I'm just gonna so the having the paper wet is gonna soften out the splatters so they won't so this is actually silver that I'm doing see there can you see that yes sorry let's do a bit more let's do a bit more not great to be doing this on my desk everything's gonna have silver splatters but that's my life that's what I do 
okay now that's also something i don't know is when to stop okay you know what i'm going to do a bit of white okay let me just try and get to my white because it's it's kind of lavender at the moment Ugh. let's see just putting the white in because it's going to be brighter okay that's it that's it we're done now we just need this lot to to dry folks so when it's dry i'll be back again we've got this all dried uh looking good we're probably gonna have to do a few repairs because when we did the smudgy around the butterflies the rubbing lifted some of the things off now before we cut i've got the excel journal because that's going to be the biggest one i want to look for my first big pocket which is this one and i want a worth i think i've measured this already i've lost my piece of paper of where's the one of five and three quarters okay so let's get let's just go like this and we want five and three quarters which is over there and i'm just gonna go like that we're gonna put that one there and we have to be how high How high we wanted it? We said eight, eh? Right, actually, this one we can go ten. <gasps> ten, we're gonna have to open him up. Open him up for ten. Oh, let's go ten. That is a humongous. I'm gonna go this way. Ten. Right. Whoops. Whoops, and we've got a little little butterfly flying off there okay right here's our journal card so let's first see so we've got all this place to journal so and we've got that place to journal so that's gonna let's see if we're gonna make it in there come on you have to fit in here I will make you fit okay, these a little sticking out there let's go like that okay I might have to trim a little bit off I just want to get that in come on we need something long and flat but we don't have anything long and flat i just want to get here and see if i've gone and i've gone and stuck it down here on this corner so how far are we going to get in okay we're going to have to chop a bit off let's neaten up this side here let's neaten up this side Oops, knock myself out. So we're gonna go like that. Okay. Didn't glue this properly. I should I think I glued this edge here. I should have left that unglued. Right. So there that's gonna fit in there. So what to do, what to do? Um think I am going to just get the aged mahogany and I'm just gonna I'm just gonna take my what's his name and just just go like that it actually feels like this cord might still be a wee bit damp that's okay. So we've 
cut that all the way around okay I think I want to do the um, corners can't find my, my corner oh here it is and I'm gonna use the big one I should have done this before I inked yeah it's not dry dry let's go this way okay that's better okay let's just see if we can tidy him up a bit hmm okay let's get you yeah it is definitely still a bit a bit damp there okay so I'm gonna leave this still to dry guys so you got the idea I might come and put some of our gold we're using a lot of this where's our gold butterflies let's um oh yeah we've got some dragonflies let's uh let's go like this and like this and I think we'll just take all of these and we will are they gonna yes they're gonna be lovely lovely accent here uh, let's see the tape's not sticky anymore Okay, where are we gonna put this? Let's put it over here. Let's stick it on this. There we go. Oh my goodness, that just lifts everything up, doesn't it? Yeah, there's a nice gold patch here. Let's put this down here. Whoopsie. Um, let's put him over here. These are dragonflies. Maybe we should keep them all. No, let's do a few dragonflies. There. And then we can put this one over here. yeah so this was a uh, so I will go through it and chop up the rest and I might, might not put some gold gold uh, butterflies on and I think uh, we're just gonna come And just give a little bit of extra gold dots this gold paint has left a lovely shimmer I really like it I feel like I want to put something here but anyway we can put the gold dots down first okay so there's our multimedia journaling card I hope you can see the can you see the the dragonflies and the butterflies lovely gold looks like it could be gold embossed and you can't really see the shiny of the plastic unless the light is reflecting off it so so that's gonna I think that's dry that's gonna go live in there happy days yay
I'm happy with that. Okay, guys, thank you for watching and staying till the very end. And thank you for the likes and subscribes and the comments. And I'll speak to you soon. Cheerio now.